So what are the key responsibilities of a board of directors? Uh, the very first thing is a board of directors really is responsible for the, the bylaws and policies of the company. So the responsibility of uh, managing the company goes from the founders, the CEO, to the board of directors. Two, when the board of directors is created, ultimately the CEO, while part of the board, is also accountable to the board. And so that transition of uh, accountability and power, so to speak, needs to be managed from a founding CEO who had complete control over the company to now the CEO being in a position to be accountable to uh, the board of directors. And that's a critical transition to make. Three is the board of directors is responsible for ensuring the financial health of the company. And so the reporting of the both financials as well as the economic model of the company to the board and the board being in a position to scrutinize it and ensure that not only is the company in good solid financial footing, growing healthily, but also has enough funding to uh, continue uh, its growth and continue sustaining itself. Number four is the, the board is responsible for protecting all the interests of all the stakeholders of the company, uh, not just the investors, not just management, uh, but all the stakeholders and all the employees. And so creating a balanced board that can look for uh, and watch for the, the, the benefit of all the stakeholders is very important. Finally, five dealing with the financial and legal health of the company and making sure that the company is abiding uh, by all the regulation it needs to and is in good solid financial and health footing.